What's up guys? We're one week into the project on Mako Drive. I want to give you an update on where we're at and kind of go over the plan on what we're doing to get this house done. In case you didn't watch the first video, we're trying to increase the home's value $50,000 by spending $11,000. My name is Brian Mayer and I'm at a house in Lexington Park. We're getting ready to put on the market in hopefully a month. So here's where we're at guys. The guy is painting currently just finished the trim the walls the ceilings everything looks good and i'm going to try to go over a couple of the things that we're going to do so in the kitchen we're going to probably keep it light we're going to get new used appliances we're going to put new cabinet pulls on right here we're going to put little gel tabs behind the cabinets so they're kind of don't bang when they when they shut and here is a lot of drywall patching done as you can see it's already making a miraculous recovery we're gonna keep the ceiling fan. This door handle right here is broken on the other side. We're gonna to need to power wash all this out here, power wash the deck. There's a light over here on the outside that needs to get replaced and the light on the front. The other thing we did is about all new um, switch plate covers, outlet covers, and they're gonna be the kind that has the no screw on them. So they're gonna look pretty good. There was some rotting on this windowsill right here, so we had to take that windowsill off and get it done. We're also taking all the door handles off, and I bought all new hinges. So we're going to put black paddle handles on right here, and then I'm going to replace all the hinges with black hinges. And these stairs right here are going to get repainted. So they're going to have white kick plates, paint them black or dark brown on the top, and then we're going to match the uh, handrail going down. The upstairs has not been painted yet. But as you can see, there's quite a bit of drywall work that's already been done. That was really the first step. There was quite a bit of drywall work that needed to be done. So all the doors have been painted. Here's the main room. They've already done the ceilings and all the trim. So all we're doing now is the walls. And then we're going to put carpet in here, but I'm going to do that last. So as far as this bathroom, depending on where we end up with the budget, I may or may not end up replacing this, but we're definitely going to replace this with a really nice one. Then we're going to put, let me zoom out a little bit. We're going to put a curved shower curtain with a white cloth shower curtain right here. This, of course, will all be painted. We're going to get a new light bar up here, a new faucet right here. Put all the hardware on the doors down here. Put a GFCI right here, which is going to end up on a home inspection. So we're going to get ahead of that by doing a new GFCI right here. Put all new plate covers on. Gonna need to sand this down, refinish this. Here's the other bedroom, which is nice and large. And one of the last things we're gonna do is have somebody come in here, take all these windows, open them, fold them in, polish them from the inside and the outside, get them sparkling clean. Get new smoke detectors. But as you can see, guys, this is coming along well. We're making a lot of progress. We're going to get new lights up here. Um, both of the hallway lights are going to be replaced. And the tile floor down here is going to get a super clean. Going to hire a company that's going to come in and try to do their best to really get this grout clean and get the tile nice and shiny there are no cracked tiles and this is a nice hard easy to clean surface so we decided not to put new floors down here one thing i did forget to mention we're going to put a new light up top here and then if we have money when we're all done i already got an estimate sixteen hundred dollars do granite countertops here here and here with a brand new sunken in sink probably going to keep that same faucet and hook up the garbage disposal. Then we're gonna to need to hook up this new dishwasher. So we might be selling some used appliances here to, to make up some money or the homeowner can do whatever she wants. And then we're getting a new light right there. So guys, we're one week into this project. We spent $3,000 to have the entire house painted. And we spent another $1,100 on all the hardware that we bought, all the lights, all the door handles, all the switch plate covers, smoke detectors, everything that we did so we're currently about and then we had spent $500 on paint so we're about $4,500 into the project we're looking good on our budget I think we're going to be able to maybe even come in a little bit under the budget 
But then I have to spend some money on the outside. We're gonna need some new shutters. Uh, there's two missing shutters on the front. And then there's a, a issue with the gutter that we're gonna to have to have a uh, roofer come and then there's a missing shingle that we need to have somebody get up and replace. So we're, part of my process is to do a pre-home inspection. So we're probably gonna have a home inspection done. And if we find any issues, we're gonna be able to cover those with the home inspection. So that's it guys. Make sure you check out the, uh, the video coming after this. Probably do two or three more to keep you updated on how this process goes. I'm doing this live, so if I fail, you're gonna watch me fail in front of the world. But if we win, you're gonna see how good it goes. <laughs>